Okay, so um, I remember a time um, it's after March, I guess mid April, and I was kind of down and out. And because my ex took our dog Milo and really didn't know what to do. And then one day I was on the Maricopa County Animal Shelter website. And I see this picture that you see here. It was a dog they had there, and his name was Milo. And as soon as I saw that picture, and seeing that goofy little face, I knew that I, I had to go there and get him from them. I headed down there. So I was headed down there. Yeah, I contacted, uh, well, the only friend I knew that would help me out with this. I said, um, I, I need some help getting my dog home. And he said, yes, where? And I said, where and when? And I headed out on the bus to go to the Maricopa County Animal Shelter and I wanted to see him before meeting him and this was just as soon as I got inside the door and there he is. He's got his own little big old area with a, a futon couch and of course as he does with everything he just has to rearrange all of the the blankets and everything on stuff. He does that to this day. But that was my first time seeing him right there. Yeah, so here he is. Um, this is the first time I was able to get close enough that he actually knew I was there. And he, he was barking at the door. And then he, all of a sudden he turned around and looked at me. And I think that he knew at that very moment he had found his forever home. And uh, they, they really do make sure that people are perfect fits for animals. I actually had to wait another hour to actually go out into a... Uh, little area where they bring the dogs out to the people, um, let them interact with them, um, give them some treats, walk them around, and um, when nice little uh, girl that, t that volunteers there and takes care of them and takes them out and things like that, she asked me do you have any questions about this? And I says, well, okay, yes, I do. Um, my first question is, what kind of toys does he like? What kind of food does he eat? And she says, you know, after we're about 10 minutes of this, she says, do you have any other questions? And I says, yeah, where do I sign to get him out of here? And she went, Milo's got a home. Our intro picture was his first moments of walking around, but as you and you'll, one of the things you'll see is the bandana he wears. Um, that was just a little triangular piece of cloth that they had tied around his neck. Um, this was after about 15 minutes being at home. He learned that he's allowed on furniture and he got a real bandana and it's not the same one he wears today but if you if you notice by his tail you see the polka dot piece of white fabric that was that triangular piece of fabric they wrapped around him and and uh, make him look cuter but he doesn't 